spider silk with the scent of a female. He just needs to follow it. Wherever it leads him. Other males have gone on the same quest and have come to a grisly end. Here's the female, and she doesn't look very amorous. In fact, she kills every male who doesn't match up to her expectations. What can he do to win her over? Dance. Dance for his life. He will need a show-stopping trick to avoid becoming lunch. With his fan unfurled, he begins an ever more complicated series of dance moves to try and seduce her. At last, she succumbs to his advances and allows him to mate with her. He matched her expectations. But she kills him anyway. So that is how it should be done. Junior returns to his own bower and tries to improve things. That should probably go just here. Or maybe here. Perhaps he was right in the first place.
He just can't make up his mind. This could take some time. And it's not just about building. The master's bower has something that juniors lacks completely. Blue decorations really please a female. And the master has gone to town. Junior takes a closer look. What will the master make of his visitor? Rather than drive him away, the master has other intentions. Seduction. Juvenile males are almost identical to females. So the master grabs the opportunity to practice his courtship display on him. Juno doesn't know what to do next. So he exits mid performance. The youngsters bower. With the breeding season close, adult males grow increasingly intolerant of juveniles. Oh dear, there's virtually nothing left. Junior will just have to start all over again. Once a mother commits herself, she commits her foe, and there will be nothing she can do to help it. is so strong it carries them downstream through the territory of ill-tempered hippos. And towards the rapids.
decision to cross here has proved to be a good one, but only just. A young fox on these barren wastes may have to travel a hundred kilometers a day searching for food. Scratching for scraps and scavenging from others. It's a meager existence. and the worst of the winter is still to come. By midwinter, temperatures drop to minus 50 degrees Celsius, and deep snow makes scavenging nearly impossible. But a faint sound beneath the snow may be this fox's salvation. Lemmings. It's time to become a hunter. But catching what you can't see is not easy. It's hard to judge the leap. And the depth of the snow. Too deep, and you get stuck. Too shallow, and it can be rather painful. It's going to take time, but mastering lemming hunting is vital if a young fox is to make it through the winter. fox is on his way. But if he is to survive until spring, he'll need to make a catch like this every couple of days. So many females gathered together on this cliff inevitably attract the attention of a rival adult male. His aim is to defeat Scarface and take over his females. He leads a group of outcast bachelors into battle. Scarface spots them. He has everything to lose because if the bachelors defeat him, they won't just take his females, they will kill his babies. The bachelors try to reach the high ground to launch their attack. Scarface warns them to keep their distance, but the bachelors continue their advance.
Scarface grinds his teeth to show he means business. But the bachelor leader reaches the cliff top and grinds his teeth in response. If Scarface loses this battle, he will lose his legacy. Time to strike. He targets the bachelor leader. Scarface has won. And he returns to a hero's welcome.